Hi, I'm Russell Lindsay, Product Manager at Enritsu. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to download map tiles for offline coverage mapping. This can be done either directly on an instrument that's connected to the internet via Ethernet or Wi-Fi, or it can be done using the MS2090 PC software. I'm going to be using the PC software for this video, but I'll show you the differences at the end. To start, open the system menu at the top left of the screen and select Tools. This will open a new menu where you can select the map tool to begin downloading map tiles. Inside the tool, you can navigate the map in the same way you use maps on your smartphone or tablet. You can drag the map back and forth. You can zoom in and out using the plus and minus buttons, the slider, or the scroll wheel on your map on your mouse. If you're on the instrument itself, you can simply pinch and zoom. Now once you've zoomed to an area that you want to map, let's say downtown Morgan Hill, open the selector tool at the bottom right of the screen and drag the corners to the edges to select the area of the map you want to download. Once the area you want is in the shaded region, press the Generate Tiles button. You'll see here that with the selection that I've made, I'll be generating 331 tiles. Note that the number of tiles is determined by the area and zoom level you choose when you download. Maximizing the number of, minimizing the number of tiles will help save storage in the instrument. Once the download progress bar hits 100%, your tiles are ready. If you're doing this directly on an instrument, this map area is now ready for offline mapping. If you're doing this on the PC, you now need to upload these tiles to an instrument. You can do this in two ways. You can export the tiles to a file that can then be transferred to any instrument via a USB stick. So that's this export button tiles. Uh, you can also upload them directly to an instrument using the instrument IP address. This requires that the instrument is on the same network as the PC you're using. When the upload is complete, you're all set for offline mapping on that instrument. Now I also have a screenshot here of what it looks like on the instrument itself. Notice the instrument does not have an upload button, but it does have an import button. This is useful for when you have a set of maps on a USB stick that you've transferred over. You click the import tiles button, go through your file manager, find the maps that you've downloaded, and import them onto the instrument. So that's how you load maps for offline mapping. Thank you for watching.